Hello everybody, it is Slar Attribution, and I am here today doing a video on Attack of the B-Team. Now I'm going to turn around and show you something. Um, it is my um, lovely looking little kind of plant place, and I have on my armor right now from the Power Suits mod that I just installed. Um, so yeah, go check that video out if you haven't seen it yet. And as you could tell, I've probably included a couple of extra things, and yes, I have. I've added some armor to these. I've added a liquid nitrogen cooling system, so if I'm in like the desert or or near a volcano, it won't begin to overheat or anything like that. Basically, that's the best way to do that. Um, added some active camouflage, so now if I press J, oh, well, I guess if I press J, I'll, I'll throw out my armor. If I press J, it'll turn off my camouflage and then turn it back on, so now I'm invisible. Um, let me turn it back off again with the letter J because that's what I've keybinded it to. And yeah, just a couple extra little things. One of them is from keeping me from getting damage if I fly up way up high and just let myself drop. It'll absorb the shock. So anyways, today we will be working on a kitchen. A um, Attack of the B-Team kitchen. So I hope you enjoy. I have actually um, made this little thing right, made these things right here because I didn't want it. It's supposed to be, it's a bar slash kitchen so when you go up so when people are you know people quote unquote were to come through here you know they can't step on the plants so I put like a little pathway you hit the elevator and then from there you can just go straight up now here it is um, I've left the cabinets here I've actually already gone out and planned the whole thing once and then I destroyed it all because I wanted to do it on camera so I've already got all the pieces ready and stuff like that for forge micro blocks and things like that now, um, yeah, I left the cabinets just so I could store the stuff in it instead of having to have the backpack in here and taking up space down below. So let's go and get started, and it should be pretty simple. So it may still take a little bit, but I know how I was doing it. So for first, let's grab these um, fancy brick slabs, and we're just going to place them from here down. So boom, boom. Um, and just to show you this room a little bit more here in a second, I will, but, um, it's pretty neat. I just kind of made it off the back of my hand. I had like, still, I had like another small space, so I decided just to do it up here and the roof is up here. It has kind of like a little skylight, which I thought was pretty neat. At some point, the moon actually does come across here along with the sun. And then if you look out, if you put it on far, you can actually see a slime island way over there, but, uh, you can only see a couple clouds when it's on normal distance. Oh, there it is. It's kind of rendering right there. But, um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and grab these. These are the next parts that we need, and we can put those on there, the panels. And now what I'm doing is I'm trying to stack it up with the forged micro blocks. It may look like I'm trying to just recreate the block, which, no, that's not what I'm trying to do at all. You'll see what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to place it to where at the very top of each block for these, there will be a little basalt cover instead of a fancy marble cover. So it is a little bit shorter than a regular uh, where was it? Here I think? Yes. Than a regular block I guess you could say. Alright, so grab these, go right here, place these on top. So now I can actually place stuff, stuff on top of these. So any type of plates or cups that I have that I want to place on top of it, I can. Boom. Okay. And then on this side we're going to have um basalt posts and uh, I have some lighting in here if you haven't noticed yet and some um, what is this uh, inverted black lanterns just for the, the customers I guess you could say like I said quote unquote customers put this stuff away next thing I'm gonna need is I'm gonna actually keep that with me next thing I'm gonna need are these and these and these and this and that and that and that which would also mean that I need one of these okay so what this is gonna look like right here is um, from this side over this is gonna be like where the people sit at so we'll go ahead and put down the chairs which we'll put one right here because otherwise that lamp uh, that lantern gets in the way one right here and then two down here because nothing really is gonna be down here on this side anyways um, 
next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and put down some of the decorations, which will be like the pots and st or the they're supposed to be cups. Now what I did is I went out and it's a pretty cool thing. You can get some carpenters flower pots and then put them down like actually I don't know if I want that one there. I don't know where the I'm not exactly quite sure where the cups and stuff were placed a while ago, but if you place these things down, it looks like um, little cups especially if you take some glass and that looks kind of like a little glass or shot glass or something like that so it's pretty neat um, pretty pretty fancy looking I guess you could say and then put uh, let's see we'll do we'll do one on either side along with a plate in the middle and then we'll do two glasses one on each side and then right here this guy's just gonna have a plate all right, put put a glass down here. Boom, two glasses. And these guys have got a couple things. This actually, this person won't have anything. Here we go. Oh, accidentally destroyed that basalt cover, which is okay because I can just place it back. But it's kind of annoying. Okay, and then also if you take one of these, it kind of looks like a little the place in the kitchen where they kind of come over to and they go through uh, this armor is actually kind of gonna kind of annoy me so I'm gonna probably take it off yep take it off my armor for right now god I can't shift click with crap right now alrighty and just because it acted a bit laggy here let's turn it to short I could tell way up here at the top is gonna start to get really um can't, I can't remember the word right at the second. Okay, we need, is it over here? Yes. We need these. The freezer and the juicer. Now, this is pretty simple, too. This is going to be like the part of the kitchen where they kind of come over to to do like the cutting and the cutting boards and things like that. And uh, here's a freezer, and then the juicer will be right there. Okay, so now what I need is these. And this looks kind of cool because it kind of looks like those metal metal cabinets that you'd always see at like a kitchen or somewhere like that. Um, and it's like it's still a pretty simple design, so fun little build. Then down here, we're going to cover up. No, we're going to cover up this one. All right, and then we need these right here. These, these, and. Actually, we really need just these, but for now we got this other stuff. Okay, so now we can go to the corners, put down one, wait, what? One, two, and it's a tight squeeze right there, but it's okay. I, it's more, this is more just for the looks. So I'm not even gonna really use this that often, except for if I want to use the um, the food mod. So it's kind of not that big a deal, anyways, but. We won't have any right here because otherwise it'll block off our little walking area for these, for right here, I mean. And I don't really want that because that's where the bartender is supposed to kind of like walk around, you know, in real life. Um, and they, But we are going to do this right here and do boom, 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 and then last but not least, boom, boom, and actually I forgot. Okay. Oh, what happened there? What happened there? What happened there? What happened there? What? What? What's? What's up right there? What? Oh, I know what it is. I can't remember last time if I had it like this. Oh, that's why. <laughs> it's because these actually do stick out past here, and then. Okay, that way, that looks kind of right. And this right, this little corner piece right there, for now I'm going to leave it because I think it looks kind of nice, but if you guys want to change it, that's fine. Just let me know in the comments. And we're going to go over here and go bang. And then we will take this cover and we're only going to place it on the freezer. And I'll show you why that is in just a second. We need two more of these. We need to go over here to... See if I can find it. It 
have I lost it? Oh, there they are. Okay. I must have just been completely skipping by it this whole time. Probably have. Um, place it like that right there, and that right there, and then like that, and like that, because it just feels like it needs some supports. And, um, get two more blocks of those, and bang, and then bang. Okay. So I think that looks kind of nice. Um, kind of cuts off some of the stuff, but that's alright. And then we need to make a little thing back here. We need to do something back here because it doesn't completely have anything else besides it's just whatever's there. So we're going to put some of these down. Um, and then we're going to put... Boom, boom. So they kind of look like little stoves. My sister says they look like little seats. So I'm not quite sure uh, whatever you guys want to think they are. So, And um, finally, boom. Okay. That's going to be like a little sink for um, washing dishes and stuff like that because they never normally wash the same wash their dishes in the same place they wash their hands or wash their hands in the same place where they wash the dishes. So that's why I'm putting that there. Um, over here in the corner, I'm going to have these two blocks, like this right here. And actually, this one's not supposed to be here. And what this is going to be is I'm going to get some potion racks at some point. Actually, it might not even be this video, and I'm going to put them here. And this is going to be the bartender's little area, just because I feel like the bartender needs an actual area, and it can't just be, you know, nothing over there. Let's go and grab out this stuff. Um... I need a sink. I need my sinks, I mean. Because there's two of them. Place them like that right there. And then this is done like. Boom, 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 boom. No, actually, this one's not here because I have. Did I put it in my inventory yet? Yes, I did. This is going to have this little crafting tape, uh, crafting station right here. Oh, I accidentally placed one more than I should have for some reason. Okay, didn't want to have to <laughs> replace the blocks. I'm too lazy to do that. Alright, and then we're going to place the fridge right there. Why not? Um, so that looks kind of nice in there. Mm, we're almost done here, actually. The oven, we need to find a place for that because the first time I did this, I did not know they had an oven, so I, that's why I kind of made these ovens. But um, since they actually have ovens, I'm gonna do two probably only one this video, but we're gonna put one right there and remove that and then place the oven head so that that way they're kind of they kind of look nicer. And then for now, we're just gonna get rid of this, but. There will be a oven here. Um, not actually quite sure how the ovens work, but they look fairly nice up there, especially considering this is a kitchen. And um, that's about it, guys. I'm thinking, do I have anything? Oh, yeah, I do know what I'm going to place somewhere else. We're going to take these. Boom, boom, boom. And then this. Let's dump off some of this stuff so I don't have to worry about carrying it around. Oh, you know what? For now, we'll actually place back a furnace. Just because I think that might actually look kind of nice with it. So we'll leave it like that. I kind of like it like that. And, um, yeah, like I was saying, we need to put some of this crap away. So boom, boom. Get rid of that, that. Get rid of that. Um, get rid of... I accidentally just opened up something on my menu. <laughs> and then go out here, take these drying racks and put them right here. Here and... Oh, does that still make me... Something don't seem right. I think it was because... So this is like one more over. It might be one more over. Um, let's move this one more over. No, actually, I like it like that. Yeah, that's all right. We'll give you, we'll give this guy the drink. There we go. Okay, and 
put this cabinet away because I want to get a picture here at the very end of what I've done so that it's for the for the um, thumbnail of the video. Take these two, place them right here and right here, and voila! Now we got a little bit of decoration behind them. So um, that's about it, guys, and I'll talk to you guys later. And let's go ahead and take the screenshot right now. So I think it was um, FN F1 FN F. Um, let's stand in this corner right here. FN F three. There we go. Oh no, it's not. There we go. Okay, guys. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like, favorite, and subscribe. Peace.